Thank you. Oh! <laughs> All right, looks okay. like you need to work a little bit. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the vlog. I hope that you're having an amazing start to your day. I'm gonna be honest with you. I woke up this morning with 102 fever, so I have a little touch of the flu, but I'm gonna be fine. You know, even me, someone that never takes time off, never ever relaxes, decides maybe it's a day to just kind of relax and try to get over this flu because I'm feeling pretty terrible. Again, nothing to worry about whatsoever. I just think I need some rest, so I think I'm gonna stay home. I'm gonna do some edits, catch up on some other things that I've been kind of pushing off, get some plans together for next door. I've got plenty to do here, but I can also rest and relax a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the camera over to Noah and Lori today and let them do the majority of the vlog. But I'll be checking back with you as the day goes on, kind of updating you on what my day is like and how I'm feeling and all that stuff because I am going to be completely fine. By tomorrow, I'll be my normal self and get over this cruddy little virus. But regardless, let's just go ahead and have the best day we can have together, push our problems aside and enjoy whatever Lori and Noah bring to us. Go ahead and go down in the comments and tell me what you guys do when you're not feeling well. What's your best remedy for me? Because I definitely need to be back to work tomorrow. While you're down there, can you smash that like button? As for now, why don't you guys head over to the shop? <sighs> Who's starting? Who's starting? <laughs> I know, I'm going to. Come on, now we're going to have to delete No, this. we don't have to delete anything. He likes to just roll with it. Well, as you guys know, Brian is homesick today, so Noah and I are going to take care of the vlog today. What else is new? If it has to get done, I'm gonna take care of it. But I'm gonna make Noah help me. So Brian not being here is actually to your benefit because you get the beauty of these faces today <laughs> <laughs> instead yep. of his. So him not being here doesn't really affect too much of what I have going on. So I'm just gonna go about my day, checking in on people, making sure they have what they need, see what's going on with them, and you get to join us for that. So. Hope you enjoy it. Oh, yeah. Stop. Right. You're All fired. right, we're glad you're here. <laughs> no, we are not firing Eric. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay, good. I was going to say. <laughs> no, that's not happening. A, I'm glad you're here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All right. B, what's on your agenda today? Oh, well, we got tons of geckos to clean here, so just that's working true. my way on down the line. Can barely see the end All of right, it, so but you're starting here and you're finishing down there, right? Yeah, yep. Before and then we leave. gotta flip over to the other side. Okay. Before I leave, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe, maybe do it right about here. But. Uh, all right, well, before you leave, I want you to be down there. Oh, so. okay, yeah, sure. <laughs> I can stand down there if you want. No, right. I just, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, we gotta get on it. We'll, we'll get it done. I got some lunch in me. Good, a little good. Ham all right, crank I'm them out. Go. <laughs> Kelsey, I'm just here checking in. Mm -hmm. And I know you guys have a lot of breeding and some stuff like that with the ball pythons, so. Yes, yeah, things have been going really well. We've got a lot of locks. Okay, well, how about you tell me or show me some of the ones you're most excited about? Okay, okay. <laughs> um, my, one of my favorite girls is our Lori Leopard right here, and she is being bred to a Enchi Pinstripe Banana, and I think that has a lot of really cool potential. I love Lori's, I love Leopard's, so I'm really excited to see what this girl produces, and it's her first breeding season. So hopefully she does well for me. Really, we got a baby with all five genes. We'd have like an Enchi, Pinstripe Banana, Lori Leopard, but the odds on that are really long. <laughs> so not holding my breath. <laughs> well, it sounds really cool. <laughs> Mostly, I just want to get more leopards. Like I'm really hoping for leopard stuff. That's okay. it. <laughs> I have a chocolate banana spinner. That's a chocolate banana pinstripe spider who's breeding to a bunch of our chocolate females. We've got chocolate pinstripes, pastel chocolates, and uh, regular, you know, basic chocolate females. And I'm really hoping for some super chocolates this year. I'm hoping I can pair him to some cinnamon or black pastel females too, because I really love the chocolate combos with that. Well, I am loving that because I love chocolate. So <laughs> chocolate anything is amazing, so I am all about that. <laughs> Well, I will leave you to get back to your work. And next up, let's try to find Jessica, see what she's doing. Uh, 
So the one thing that you guys may not know about me, I mean you probably do by now, is that I don't do relaxing well. I don't like to sit around and do nothing. I don't like to have like days off. So when I'm forced to <laughs> relax because I'm feeling sick and I just feel weak and I just can't do things, it's terrible for me. I mean, yeah, I've been editing, I've been returning emails, I've been doing some planning for next door and some whole bunch of other things I've got going on. Uh, so my mind is staying active. But just sitting here and knowing that I'm not going out today is just like, oh, I hate that feeling. I hope that everything's going well at the shop. I know it is because Lori and the crew always take care of things. They certainly don't need me there. But man, my heart is there now. I wish I was sitting over there now knowing what is going on. But regardless, I know the best thing for me to do is definitely get some rest so that tomorrow I can get back to work. One of the things I'm kind of excited about that we're breeding this year are Indian sand boas. We have a bunch of different kinds, but these are kind of cool and very different. So we've been pairing these up and as you can see here, this is our male, which is a sunset, is very pretty. And then we've been breeding him to some of the normal females. And they're starting to look really beefy and big. So I think this is kind of exciting. And hopefully, you know, we've got a half a dozen females or so. So we have potential to have quite a bit of babies, even though these guys here have very small litters uh, because the babies are so big, they probably will have four, maybe five babies tops. So you don't get big quantities, but um, they are very cool animals. So fingers crossed, um, looking good that we'll have babies of these this year. Jessica, just checking in, see how things are going. Going pretty good. It's uh, getting a little slow here on the breeding, but. Yeah, well, I know we've got a lot of breeding though, right? And yeah. it doesn't take that much for yeah, it's been about a month do. and they only go for about a month, so I think okay. we're going to in here. Tell me which ones we're most excited about, like right. what lockups or matchups do we have? Yeah, that one is a really for pretty one. Very red. Oh yeah. They'll make some beautiful babies, I think. Definitely. This is one of my favorite pairs. <laughs> yeah, he, he looks would, like he oh, wants yeah. to breed. <laughs> yeah, I need to try him today. Maybe he'll get a couple more locks out of him. Uh, yeah, no, that's beautiful. That's Those are going to be very favorite. cool. I can tell you what, the one thing I'm worried about is, yes, we want to produce really nice babies, but when we produce really nice babies, Ryan wants to keep them all. So I'm very torn about this. <laughs> Here we've got a hypo northern and um, a hypo northern male. So I, th I like the color, like the reduced pigment in these guys. Yeah, yeah, she's got some really nice pink on her too. He's got a lot of nice pink on him yeah. too. Yeah. Like fresh out of shed. She's nice and fat too. Yeah, I'm hoping she's so, pregnant. <laughs> that's what we start to see right now is, is they start getting all chunky and, and big and uh, that's a good sign and that makes us happy. Oh yeah, Great these animals. are super cool. Yeah, the coloring on these guys is amazing. Wow. This is pretty exciting for us. We should definitely have a pretty good year this year. And uh, I know Jessica worked really hard at it and we appreciate it. And it's nice to uh, to get some little babies here for sure. But like I said, oh, that's just my concern is that- uh, He's gonna wanna keep all of them. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna have that special page on the site, the Lori's picks <laughs> that Brian doesn't know about. So. <laughs> Stay tuned for that. <laughs> okay, well, I'll leave you to finish up what you're doing and I'll finish up what I gotta do. All right, sounds good. <laughs> right. You know, I've been kind of sitting around resting all day and, you know, doing a bunch of busy work, but I wanted to thank you guys because to be totally honest with you, you guys know that I love reading your comments, love interacting with you, but today that's helped me a lot because, well, my mind is just like, oh my gosh, I've been able to just kind of go back and read comments and respond and, and it's just kind of keeping my spirits up when my body is kind of down, if you know what I mean. So thank you guys so much. Lori's going to be home in a couple hours and I'll be happy to kind of see what they did today when I review their footage and just talk to Lori and not feel so lonely here. So I'm hanging in there, but anyone that knows me personally knows that I am a crybaby when it comes to feeling bad. When I got the flu, I am the worst to be around. So uh, Lori's probably lucky she's not here with me. Oh, what are you doing? Taking some videos of this beautiful orange pop snake. An orange pop snake? Yeah, it's a sun kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Which, 
which animal, <laughs> which which snake is it that is orange pop? <laughs> the fago cream? <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. I'm taking videos for the Instagram and Facebook. Nice. So that's what's been keeping you busy lately? Yeah. You're the one who's in charge of all of our social media videos and pictures? Yeah, pretty much. Very nice. Well, I feel like you've been doing a good job, so keep up the good work. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Oh! <laughs> all right. Looks okay. like you need to work a little bit harder on getting okay. more comfortable, but uh, yeah, it's coming along. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I will leave you to your video and picture -ness. Thank you. Right. Okay, guys. I'm just finishing up here. Got my last cup of coffee for the day, and I am going to head home and check on Brian. Hopefully, he's still alive. Um, I'm sure he is, but you know, guys, when they're sick, they think they're dying, so I gotta go check on him, maybe bring him some soup and see how his day has been. All right, guys, so it is evening and I'm actually feeling a lot better. My fever is basically gone. I knew I just needed some rest and I'm gonna be completely fine. And my prediction is I'll be back to work tomorrow and everything will be awesome. I hope that you enjoyed Lori and Noah kind of taking over and seeing what's going on there because they really did pick it up for me. I was really not in the shape to do much of anything today. So I hope that you guys enjoyed that departure from the norm and I hope that you guys have an absolutely amazing day, evening, morning, whenever you happen to be watching this. Thank you for putting up with my kind of illness for the day, but I promise I'm going to be back to normal tomorrow. Can you do me a couple favors before we get out of there? Can you smash that like button for me, as well as turn those post notifications on so you know when I upload a video, which is every day, seven days a week at nine o'clock in the morning, Eastern Standard Time, even when I'm sick. Make sure to be kind to somebody, and I promise I'm going to see you guys tomorrow.